Amy Schumer's latest Netflix stand-up special sucks, and she blames the alt-right. Amy Schumer just released a new stand-up show on Netflix. It received one star. Now, she's not taking the blame for any of it. She says that it's all the alt-rights and trolls. Now, I was an Amy Schumer fan. I liked her previous stand-up specials. I liked her show, Inside Amy Schumer. And I didn't even mind the movie train wreck that she was in. So I was kind of anxious to watch this. So I clicked on the old play on Netflix and I watched this train wreck. It was horrible. Now, again, I was an Amy Schumer fan. I didn't get a phone call or an email from the Republicans who said, hey, don't worry about the uh, scandal about the Russians and getting involved in the election, go over and give Amy Schumer one star. Don't worry about anything else that's going on in the world. Stop whatever you're doing and go give Amy Schumer one star. Didn't happen. Here's what did happen. Amy got so famous, she thought she could just sit back and phone it in. Amy got so popular and it went to her head, she thought that uh, she could just go up in there and stand and do her little funny things, do her little funny voice, and say pussy and come 45,000 times, and everyone would just laugh. So it wasn't a gang of Republicans. It wasn't a bunch of trolls. It was you, Amy. You blew it. There was no setup. There was no punchlines. There was no cadence. There was no show. There was no comedy. There was nothing. It was just you standing up there saying, come, 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 pussy, pussy, come, come, pussy, pussy, come. That's all it was. I didn't laugh once. The blame's on you. Don't put it out there and say, oh, it was because of this. It wasn't because of a group of men that hated you. It wasn't because of anybody's political stance that they didn't like it. It wasn't none of that. It was because you sucked. You phoned it in. You didn't perform at all. You put zero effort into this special, and it shows. You went from the little comedy girl to the famous actress comedian. Your popularity grew, and you got lazy. Well, we won't put up with it. If you stink, you stink. So maybe you weren't out there, and your face wasn't in the public for a while, and you felt the need to get out there, and you just whipped something together. And yeah, whatever. You phoned it in and it didn't work. Just say you were off. You had a bad show. Don't go point fingers and blaming this group and that group and it wasn't your fault. It was your fault. So that's why I used to be a Schumer fan. No more. I could have accepted a bad show and said, hey, we'll wait for the next one and I'll still be a fan. But you know what? After all that crybaby bullshit, not a fan anymore. This is Blind Views. Thanks for watching. And yep. That's the way I see it. What we do here is go back, 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 back.